How's it going, you guys? New Age here with episode 3 of our live TCG online series. So, uh, I don't remember if we won, if we even won the last one or not. But, uh, I mean, you know, whatever. Actually, I don't think we did. We won the first one, we didn't win the second one. But, like I said, I'm not even keeping score of this. This is just when I feel like recording when I'm playing and just, just hanging out, calling it a day. Last video I'm recording for the day, so I'm... This cons this is considered my uh, chillin' after all this recording I've done, so which I'm cool with that. Cause a little TCG never hurt anybody. So uh, I am still using my grass stick. Uh, I haven't really changed anything. I did get a shaman, so I was thinking about changing one of the genesects for shaman, cause I have two genesects and I don't really think I need that. So we're going up against a dragon electric deck. Um, I mean, we'll see how that goes, I guess. <laughs> like I said, I still don't know much about this game other than how to play it, so... Uh... I think I might actually start with Mew. Because if I get left with Mew, I basically have nothing to hit with after that, so... And Mew can still go ahead and get that uh, call for family going. Uh, and Miltank, not bad. So, gonna throw that down, grab me some energies, and... I can't use Call for Family on the first turn, that's fine. So, just gonna throw energy on Mew. Call it a day. And if any Pokemon tries to attack. So, the sand attack might suck because it doesn't say it doesn't do damage, it says it doesn't do anything, so. That's cool. I'm always sketchy about Dragon Decks. I don't see why people run them just because the energy requirements is so weird, but. At the same time, I've gotten beaten by a pretty fair share of uh, Dragon decks, so... What in the hell? Well, I guess that's one way to do it. Can I, like, click on that? Or no? So, oh, there you go. Provides when this card is attached to a Pokemon, it provides those. Okay. That's cool. Actually, I'm pretty... No, I can't kill this thing. Actually, oh nope. Damn. Wait. How much HP is this? I can't kill it. Let's do that then. Call it a day. Oh, I have to flip a coin. Oh, I got heads. So, uh. Bam, you dead. Oh, wait, what? Why did I have to flip a coin? Twice. What? Why did I have to flip a coin twice? Okay, I'm done. Uh, search your deck for a dragon, reveal it, put it into your hand. Okay. So, uh, he has to put another energy on if he wants to attack, but that'll only do... Well, it'll do 40, actually. Um. Alright. So, screw that. I'm just gonna go back to what I was trying to do. And get my call for family on. Uh, then I can go ahead and get, uh... Rizion out, which is cool. I mean, okay. I'm just going to use one of my switches because I don't want to waste the energy on that. And... Yeah, it's an item card, so... Yeah. Draw three. Uh, switch for Mew. Call it a day. Get a whole bunch of energies out of my deck. Actually, yeah. I will. Might as well thin out my deck a bit even more. Uh... <laughs> have way too many energies. There are energy on Jasect and get that call for family going on. Bring out uh, Virizion so I can't be status and Snivy so I could uh, get to work with that evolution right there. I am afraid of Garchomp coming out because uh, that's definitely deck for a dragon Pokemon so he can get uh, Garchomp out of his deck but I guess he's just gonna evolve both of his Pokemon into Gabites first. Oh no, he has two, so now he could search his deck for two dragons each turn. This is starting to get bad. So I do need to uh, take this thing out sooner than later. I didn't even see what he grabbed. Another Gibble. Oh my gosh, this man is about to go crazy with some deck searching right here. And uh, he can hit me with Garchomp. Uh, I don't really care if he takes off the special energy, because... And that's fine too, honestly. Because uh, I'm going to start getting energies out of my deck. Um, damn, that's gonna do 80 though, that's a lot. 
Damn. Well, good news is I could use the Evo Soda on Snivy. So that's cool. Um, let's see. I'm gonna have to hit with the uh, energy search next turn. Damn. This is, yeah, this is starting to get bad. This is starting to get bad. Okay. I guess that's one way to do a dragon deck, is if you just have a whole bunch of those. Never mind. Uh, he's just, he's just gonna kill me. Okay. So there goes Mew. Um. I can't attack with Rizzy. Uh, Rizzy on right now, so I think I'll just get another call for family going while building up the energies on Verizion. Um, there's not. I, I'd rather save uh, Lissandre for more intense situation that I feel like is coming. So that'd be great if we could get the Snivy uh, or a Servine to evolve. That'd be cool. I'm not gonna get both just because I may need Buffalon later on. So let's see this went from me potentially being able to just end this on the first turn to getting progressively worse and worse. If there's one thing I've learned from playing card games it's that you do not give people time to set up their stuff. And uh, I fear this may have been something I've done. Then again, well no, he has another one to evolve so he could search again. That's really good, actually. Even though I, I don't know if I'll use a dragon deck anytime soon. Wow, he is just getting nice and set. Yeah, I don't like where this is going. So he can hit me for another 120. Uh, he, please use the Hypnotoxic Laser. He can't status me. I'd love if he didn't know that. Because of Verizion's ability, since Genocide has a grass energy on it, uh, that Hypnotoxic Laser would just go to waste. Please use it. Please do. Please do. Oh, nope. So, uh, he's gonna put that back into... Oh, he has Lissandre and N. Damn. I wish I had more Lissandres. Then again, I don't really get the packs for that one, so I just have one. So he did grab Lissandre. Oh, he's looking to take some out. He can't, though, because he used... Wait, what? Search your deck. Oh, it's a different Lissandre. I thought he gets one from the discard pile. Uh, but he can't use Lissandre this turn because... Uh, for reasons. I think... Hmm... Uh, Yeah, this is not going well. I need to hit this thing. So let's retreat that and then throw some grass energies on our other Genesect. Uh, I can't see this going well, honestly. But that's never stopped me from trying. So Garchomp has 90 HP left, which sucks because Jet Impact won't kill it. Um, and he kind of does have the option to just kill something now. So now I'm interested to see what else he's bringing out, if he's just going to keep on getting Garchomps. This deck is something else. Taking on an army of Garchomp. Like, wow. No, a different... No. Different art, same Garchomp. Wow. Who knew this could be so good? Come on. Uh, I'm ready. I'm ready for what you got. What's that? Yeah, well, once Verzion goes, I can get poisoned, so I'll have to keep that in mind try and keep Verizion alive if I can. That'd be great. Mm. 
so he is using the Sandre now, which I'm kind of okay with. Uh, even though Servine's gonna go, it does help me uh, keep Verizion out. So I'm gonna go into Genesect now. Uh, if I could get heads, which I really need for this draw, uh, the Garchomp will be nice and gone. So I really need that here. Come on, please get heads. Please, 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 please. Damn it. I suck so bad when it comes to coin flips. You don't even know. And that Garchomp only has one energy for retreat costs. That's ridiculous. So, uh, he is free to hit me with whatever. Uh, I don't know if he's gonna retreat. He doesn't have energies on anything else. So that's kinda cool. Come on, now. So he is just gonna go straight away and take out the, uh, Genesect, which is cool because now I can go into Viruzion and, uh, I'll be pretty cool to hit it with whatever. The mock cut hits really hard. That's ridiculous. Okay, so, I think I'll throw energy on Genesect, and then put two more on Genesect, honestly. Now I finally get to take out the Garchomp. Uh, as far as I know, Brizion isn't dying this turn. This card, two cards, so yeah. I'm pretty sure most he could do to me is 130. Um, so that attacks a Pokemon, so that'll do 90 to me. Which I don't want to take that either. But it's getting down to a point where I don't really have much of a choice. What is that? Combination of... okay. So he can... Uh, I guess he's gonna try and search for the Gibble again. Pretty sure he already evolved all of his uh, goodbites, though, so I don't see why that matters. And all his guard chops. He already used four. Can only have four. Let's see what we got. He can put energy on and attack me. It's not going to kill me, but I can't let Brizion die either because then he wins. And you know what? I'm I'm down to just drag this out for as long as I need to. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> it's been a while since I've had some some fight in me. Well, not really. On showdown, I don't let myself go down easy, but lately I haven't really had a choice. He's thinking about if he could take me out right now, I'm sure, but I don't think he can. Put a trainer card from your discard pile into your hand. What's he trying to get? Oh, the Sandre. No? He could take out Genesect if he manages to be able to switch it or something. Dang, he was just going crazy with his deck right now. Oh, so now he's got enough back um, to where he can bring out another Garchomp. That's a good card, Super Rod. So he's just grabbing his hand back now. I have the Juniper too. I think I'll throw down Bufalon, put an Energy on. Um, Maybe get rid of that Gibble. That'd be cool. But I'll, I'll have to switch out. Damn. Alright, let's see. Mmm. Yeah, this is not looking good. Throw our energy on Bufalant. He says good game. Well... I don't give up that easily now. Come on. So... 
I am just going to use Lissandre for now. And, uh... Damn, I can't even have him use the mock cut on me, because then that's going to take away my double colorless. Uh... Yeah, all I can really do is just call that a day and then draw Juniper next turn. Or use Juniper to draw next turn. But... Since I can't use uh, two support cards in the same turn, <laughs> he's gonna try and poison me. All I have to do is put a grass energy on, and I'm good. I mean, it doesn't really matter if I'm asleep or poisoned or any of that. I mean, I don't see myself winning this, but I'll keep going until I actually lose. So he's got a sand attack, too. So he's just going to switch that out, hit me for 40, take off the energy. Uh, let's see. I got Mew. That would have been nice to have. So I'm just going to use Juniper and see what I get before I put any energies down. Yeah, there's the, the Pokemon Center ladies. But uh, too little, too late. And... I can't switch, uh, I can heal the poison off him, but that's about it. And uh, that's that's gonna be a game. We don't say good game though, because if we lost, it wasn't good game. Well no, it's not true. But this wasn't good game. It was bad game. Oh. Hold on guys. That's alright, I'll just cut it back to right here. Alright, uh, sorry about that guys, I had to stop recording because I was interrupted, so, yeah, basically, didn't work, it wasn't gonna work out, anyways, uh, that turn he was just gonna be able to take me out, so, uh, that would've been the game, and, uh, yeah, that's okay though, cause, like I said, still, still a work in progress. Up until, you know, maybe that one day will come when we can actually have some pretty solid stuff in the deck. And we can be the ones wrecking shop and all that good stuff. So, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave a like. If you want to see more, you can subscribe to my channel, New Age Steel, where I upload multiple videos every single day. And you can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter, where I post first-hand information on when I upload videos to the channel. So, until then, I'm New Age Steel. Keep on watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Okay.